Hello everyone, this is Jasper from Export Feed. Today I'm going to show you how to upload your Shopify listings to your Etsy account. Now before we start, um, since Shopify and Etsy are completely different, um, there may be some things that you can do in Shopify that you can't do to Etsy. In that regard, I highly recommend you to visit this um, URL right here or www.exportfeed.com slash etsy dash requirements dash and dash restrictions just have a quick look and read about what are the things that you can do or what to have before um, starting the process now on top of that there are also a couple of things to note or a couple of common things that you may bump into um, in terms of uploading your items to Etsy one of them is the error oh dear you cannot sell this item on Etsy error now since Etsy only accept handmade items, it will not allow you to upload branded items. Let's say for example, you're trying to sell um, branded items like Nike. Since obviously that is not a handmade product, um, Etsy will detect that and automatically prevent you from uploading that. The second common error is the um, attributes error. Etsy will only allow you to upload at a maximum amount of two variation if you have uh, more than two variation it will automatically prevent you from doing so another common error that you may bump into is that when you're trying to upload um, some items and some of the items or variation doesn't have any stock in it um, it will it will only allow you to upload um, listings that you're in stocked having said that you need to make sure that the quantity is not less than one since Etsy charges you 20 cents for every listings that you put up on Etsy um, when you're uploading your items from Shopify to Etsy it will only pick up the things that are not less than 20 cents because obviously you're not gonna have a, any profit if that's the case having note of all these things uploading your items from your Shopify account to your Etsy store should be um, quick and easy Let's go ahead and crack on to the tutorial, tutorial video anyway. To start with the process of uploading your products to Etsy, you're going to want to make sure that all of the products that you want to upload are already added into a collections. So let's see for example, say here um, you, have, you already have a bunch of products. You're going to want to go to collections all right, and add create a collection for all those items that you're going to want to upload to Etsy. In this case, I already have made um, a collection which is named tutorial video collection because it's a, it's a tutorial video and I have added all the three items that I want to upload to Etsy. The next thing that you're going to want to do is go to your app. This is the back end of Shopify by the way and um, select Etsy and share a sale integration which is our application. Just wait for it to load up and there you go. So next step would be um, clicking, on, clicking on sell on Etsy right here. Wait for it to load up and then select the collection that you want to upload. Right here tutorial video, video collection and then select the category that you wish to add it to. Right now this is not important for me since I'm just showing you how it's done. But um, yeah, obviously you don't want to make sure that it's um, listed in the right category. So I'm just going to select a random category right here and then um, select continue. It will also um, prompt you to um, enter um, like a, a file name or something that you will be able to recognize when browsing through the um, Etsy store. In this case, I'll just name it as tutorial video. And when you're done or ready, um, hit create product listings. And there you go. As you can see here, all the three items are listed in here. And then once the application is done in verifying all those three products, um, you can upload the, uh, the products. Now to proceed with the process, you're going to need to click on this button right here. But you might have noticed that it says re-upload to Etsy. 
This is because I've already tried uploading this earlier to just to test it. That's why it's showing that. Anyway, if I click on that button, it will go ahead and pick up all of those information from Shopify and then upload it to Etsy. This is the page where you can usually see if there's any errors or if there's anything in conflict when you're uploading the products. So let's just give it a couple of minutes or second and yeah, there you go. Your product now is available to Etsy. Now to verify that, we're going to need to log into Etsy right here and check to our listings and um, which I believe you can go to account settings go to listings and as you can see there's no items on active because it will go to your draft instead so you will have the option to actually list it so these are the three items that I have uploaded. As you can see, ring, butterfly earrings, and necklace. These are the three products that I've selected. Now that the upload is successful, I highly recommend you to review the, the, the details of your products. And now uh, when it's complete, you can go ahead and publish them when ready. Please do note that for every listing that you published on Etsy, Etsy charges you 20 cents for those items. You can also refer to this article right here that allows you to connect your Etsy account to your Shopify account using our application. You can find this article by going to exportfeed.com slash documentation slash Shopify dash two dash Etsy dash products dash guide. Again, this is Jasper from Export Feed. Thank you very much.